Hello. Good morning. A little on the loud side, but that makes some sense. We'll turn it down a little bit. Hi, pause. I hope you're doing well today. Oh my goodness. I am so tired. Maybe we should all just go back to sleep. Whatever. <laughs> Let's go ahead and continue. Oh, we're playing more Digimon. Last time things happened and I can't remember what they were. Let's go. I need to mute this conversation because people are talking about a thing. I'm going to be honest. I just don't care about right now. Okay. We got Digimans. I added Karamon to the team because I got enough data from it. I think I said in my tweet that I didn't really like play at all. I played for like the last hour. I ended up doing a bunch of the side quests because they were all like really quick. There was one. Let's see if I can find it. Oh, the auction scam right here we go so this one says it's in kowloon level one it straight up lies to you it's in kowloon level three and i had to look it up it was the one that i was stuck on last week too on top of that when i did find the npc right um i tried talking to them it didn't work their actual like point where you can talk to them was like behind where they were standing so like this Mission was just programmed like terribly. It was great. Thanks, localizers. Anyway, I do still have a few more missions we can try. So I think these are all domination battles. This one is at least. Let's do this. Yay. Who should I ask first? Ryuji. Also, it's like uh, you can you can kind of see it behind me. It's like sunny for the first time in a week today. Holy crap! It did snow yesterday, which was nice, but it's been raining for most of the past week. It's been awful. But we're fine now. Everything's chill. Where's the... Oh, they're back there. Okay. Just start us on these spaces. Don't make me waste turns just jumping out in front. Ugh. Right, we'll grab the center. Wipe out the enemy team? Oh. So I don't even need to. Okay. I just gotta fight all of them. It's not about getting points. Yeah, I'm playing a lot of Pokemon. Um, I learned of. You're just curious to read this anyway. Um, like the best way to get money in it is with like a Pixelate Sylveon, and just like constantly using uh hyper voice um you also need like a very specific ev spread just to, like make sure you can you're outpace certain things and don't die to other things but once you have it all set up all you need to do is mash the a button and you just earn money so i ordered a turbo controller um so that'll hopefully be here like by wednesday so I can set that up and just earn money in Pokemon. While I'm not playing anything else on my Switch.
it's kind of great. At least it will be. Why did we get so many boosts? Yeah, looking uh, looking forward to that. Good night. I trained up a team in Pokemon. Um, I guess just move here. I did a little bit of shiny hunting. I already talked about like my dragon shiny hunt, which was very lucrative. Um, but I've been like doing some outbreaks and I haven't really found anything. I did that night. I think it might have been the next day, actually. The the day where I found all the dragon type Pokemon, I ended up finding a shiny Psyduck that day too. So. That was kind of cool. They tell you about what ha uh, was happening during my shiny scatterbug hunt? No. What happened? Was it hilarious? Fuck. You know, I knew I should have sent my main character over here. Oh well. I did a scatterbug outbreak for six hours before I found a shiny scatterbug. I found two shiny Lechonk and two shiny Hopep. That's awesome. That's trade material right there. Also, with the Lechonk, you can like evolve either one of them or both of them if they're both genders and you'll have like different shinies. And like with the Hopep, you can evolve one of those to like skip loom or jump fluff. I'm viewing this as a win. Yeah, I was trying to shiny hunt. I, I had a similar thing happen, except I didn't go for six hours. I tried shiny hunting Reverum for a little bit during an outbreak, and I found my shiny Go Goat. Which, like, eh. I'm not the biggest Go Goat fan. I was happy to get the shinies, but I just wanted the worm. Does. What does shiny Vivalon look like? Isn't his body, like, white or something? I know they can't really change the patterns on the wings because the wing pattern is supposed to be like a regional thing. But then all the ones in Paldea, like no matter where your game is, are just the same. So. Pretty. It's pretty. Okay. Oh. Go ahead, turn this in. Hacker rake up. Oh, they're still going. Okay. Shiny Speedspeed is one of the best shinies that we... That, that, no. That can't be right. One of the best... Okay, it's a pretty good shiny. Swapping the colors around a little bit. I don't know about best, but... I'll give it to you that it's pretty good. I said one of. I, I I still I don't know if I would say one of them, but there, there's a lot of good shinies. Pause. To say shiny spupa is like among them, I I don't I don't know. I I'm pressing next to doubt at the moment. Pressing next to doubt just a little. Uh, let's go. Investigate more cases. Since we just got our rank up, I think that means we're going to be able to get even more cases now instead of just getting items all the time. Caramon's already level 20. Wow. Level 22. I need 55 intelligence. 
Or I need to have cleared hacker's memory. Our intelligence is 37. I kind of doubt that's going to get all the way to 55 in two levels. So we're just going to evolve this now into, I guess, any one of these three. Because I don't think we've had any of them so far. So I'm hoping for Kurosarimon. Because, you know, Devamon's my boy. Not Devamon. Um, fucking Deboromon. It's, it's devil, but a different language. Diablomon. So, but we'll see. Might get Platinum Sukumon. Who knows? I actually forget, dude. Did you even have abilities in this game? Bakamon. Damn it. Good morning. Hi, Fig Leaf. How are you? You got work off today, right? Since you worked last night? I got a Bakamon. Lekismon. Rapidmon. Vegemon. Waspmon. Stingmon. We still have a chance to get Mega Kabuterimon, right? Yeah, we're actually very close. We just need like a really good like defense up or to get three more levels probably. Working last night doesn't mean I'm off, but I am. Hi, pause. Well, you're the one that said that you get Saturdays off, but it's at the expense of having to work night shifts now. Ready to splat later? Oh yeah, what's, it's Splatfest, huh? What, what's the, um, what's the theme? Okay. So that's all set. Yeah, I just decided not to give me Saturdays for now. Oh, okay. Favorite fruit sensation, spicy, sweet, or sour? See, I have to go with sweet. I would want to say spicy, but I can't handle spice as much as I like it. And sour is nice on occasion, but I can literally sit here and eat like, I don't know, like a family-sized bag of like, little Hershey bars or Kit Kats or whatever and not bat an eye my blood probably hates it but you know I enjoy it two new cases added uh, it's a domination battle and golem lost an item again Talent level two. What's everyone else going with? See, if it was like spicy, sweet, or savory, I think I would have more of a hard time picking because, like, I like savory stuff too, like, you know. Or even just salty. I feel like there's better options than sour. Like, how often are people like, yes, yeah, sour is one of my favorite taste sensations. I would ask if that person's okay. Lemon, uh, I'm not a big fan of like, I guess citrus fruit, but like, I'm not the biggest fan. Also, lemons have sweetness to them too, especially if you have like lemonade. I may have picked spicy if it wasn't on team. I promise to ensure pause had people to play with. It's a meme. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. Fucked it up. I didn't mean to. Anyway. Did enough people really not pick sweet? Because, pause, you had to have picked sweet, right? I'm not crazy for thinking you picked sweet. Uh, 
Get another goblin, man. And we got this. Uh, free gate. Pause 100% pick sweet. Okay, that that's what I thought. Control copy. Hold on. Would you stop playing? Okay, volume's fine. Okay. <laughs> All right, then. To be fair, I didn't say it made sense. I, yeah, memes often don't. Memes often do not. Um, hmm. Legendary Digimon. I feel like I should do the yellow and red ones after the green. Because I feel like these might be story related. Whereas these are just from your eye being like, there's people we want to beat up. Go do it. We'll take Chito saying you this time. Let's get hacking. And it's the love thing again. Okay. Yeah, 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 whatever. No, don't stand by. I feel like I fight these three so often. Like, can you not just, like, can you just not cause trouble for like five minutes? Um, spiking strike. Oh, it's actually super effective on Lunamon. I don't think I realized that. I would really like to digivolve Stingmon at some point, but I I want to get that last like option available since since we're doing it randomly. I don't want to just not try to like get every option available when I do digivolve. I suggest you just stay there. Okay, never mind. Um, eh, Crescent Leaf's fine. I should double check their attacks too. Has there ever been a more common rider ass Digimon than Stingmon? If you told me his Japanese name was like Commonmon, I would I would be like, yeah, of course it is. Why wouldn't it be? I'll go ahead and steal this.
go ahead and block her in. Despite the fact she could just try to go around. Oh no, we got back at attack. This is the worst day. Yeah, since I'm not playing this on my own time like I was with the first one, it doesn't feel like I'm digivolving enough. Would you expect me to pick anything else? No. But, you know, I, I also didn't want to just outright be like, yeah, you absolutely suck down. Damn. Oh, shit. Why am I asleep? I love spicy food, but I can only eat it in small amounts. But I can eat sweets all day. I mean, same. Like, absolutely same. Pause. You, you and I are very much alike in that sense. Where, like, I, I love, I love spicy food. I cannot eat a lot of it. It will kill me. Ooh, nightmare too. It honestly sucks. Like. I want to eat so much spicy stuff. Like, whenever I have spicy stuff, I never taste the flavor of the spicy stuff. It's always just, my mouth is dying. So. I want to check some settings. Meteor fall. Okay, we don't actually have a fire attack. Hmm. Hmm. I guess we could just not use critical charge. You meteor fall instead. Oh wow, your intelligence is way higher than your attack. Yeah, so Nightmare 2 is just gonna be a straight upgrade to Destruction Cannon. Okie dokie. Vegemon, I really wanna Digivolve Vegemon too. I'm gonna be honest, I'm kinda sick of having Vegemon be our partner because they're just not good. I might cheat with Vegemon and like, if we roll Vegemon again for whatever reason, just not not do Vegemon. Because this is the second time it's Digivolved to Vegemon. And I, like, I don't mind Vegemon as a design. What I do mind is the fact that it just, it's not good. It's not a good Digimon. You should lift more weights. Command, train, no cam down, please. I mind this design. Why? It's a fine design. It's a Digimon. It's one of the quintessential Digimon. It looks weird, yeah. And there's a variant just called Weedmon. But, like, it's not that bad. Right? <laughs> Anyway, uh, we're looking for defense 95, SP and intelligence 95. Let's see, SP is only a 61 without the boost. Intelligence is getting up there. It's ugly. How dare you? That's my starter Digimon you're talking about. How could you hate that face? It's a good face. 
rude. Calling my Digimon ugly. Anyway, uh, we can get attack 55 on you, right? Yeah, we're at 53. Actually, super close. Garumon, I don't think we can get because Cam, I have to like Digibob up and down and up and down, so. We'll go with the other options sooner. Hmm. Oh yeah, we got Gabrimon and Wanyamon. space in the thing can I buy anything new please nope okay I think that's all I'm doing here right everyone's all fine and healed up all right cool and we got any plans today I don't think we, I have plans. Fig Leaf, are there any plans that we had to do? I don't remember. Legendary Digimon. Anti Metal Greymon League. This might be tough. I could possibly lose this one. So I only have one ultimate right now. Despite the fact I could have more. But, you know. Uh, we're definitely gonna need Ryuji. And I guess Chitose would be better than you? I'm ready now, let's get hacking! Okay, and this isn't even like a, a domination battle. It's go beat up everybody. And there are also three ultimates, so this might be rough. You know, I think we might have been getting boosts based on the number of spaces we had. So maybe I should concentrate on grabbing those. Okay, yeah. Let's do that. Because we're gonna need them. Okay, Ryuji's got at least That's an crazy. ultimate, so I'll probably be fine. Also, I just said, I gotta say, I've said before, I hate Shine Greymon's design, like, Wholeheartedly. I actually really love Rise Greymon though. Like, that's a good design. It's it's a bit too like manly instead of dinosaur-y. But if we had this as an in-between between like Greymon and like War Greymon, I could see that. I could absolutely see that. Anyway. What type are you? You're a vaccine. So I want to hit you with a data, which is my rookie. Okay. Yeah, let, let's just Desolation Claw. Oh, that wasn't a lot. Um, attack charge Doruman? We're not very high level, huh? Uh, hmm. I guess Heavy Strike might be our best option. Oof. Okay. 
Granted, I can concentrate on grabbing more of these spaces. It's my hacking business. It's my hacking business. Oh, two champions and a rookie. Okay, and Kilamon's tough though. Big big buff big buff man. Fifteen percent chance to stun, but like what are we stunning, right? Probably better if I just do common hammer. Oh good lord. Okay. Um holy shot? Okay, much better. Uh a hydro water too didn't even hit it. Okay. It's my hacking business. I'm gonna grab this and we're gonna see what Metal Greymon does. Okay, he's just going for the throat. Got it. <laughs> Ha! You call that an attack? Um. Yeah, we'll, we'll do spiking strike. Big oof. Increase my base stats isn't gonna help at all. Physical attack. So here's the thing, I actually don't know what's higher on Rapidmon, if it's just attack or physical, and I can't check either. So we'll go with a Saint's Knuckle. Yeah, this isn't gonna deal a lot of damage anyway, so we'll just go with a cheaper one. If I go take this, they'll probably just nab this space. Hmm. You know what? I think just waiting is probably my best bet. Cause then they'll try to attack me. I can hopefully we just withstand it. Oh. Well, ten percent chance to instantly KO. Let's see it. Damn. We will crit charge Dorumox. We already got an attack charge on it. And then what did I do last time? I think I did heavy strike. Boom. Just slapped it real hard. Okay. I think same thing here. I'm better off waiting. Oh. I mean, that's fine by me. That's less fine. Holy crap. Um. Speed charge doesn't do anything. We'll just use that. Also, as much as I really want to use Quaxley with the way my team composition is looking, I don't think I can. Well, what, what's up with your team comp? Pause. Tell me all about it. Just avoid spoilers. Because, like, I did have to... I did have to scold, um... 
uh, Luke last night for revealing who the uh, big bad of Team Star was, so. Okay, I'm gonna have you back up over here to get us another attack boost. Oh, you motherfucker. Okay. I kind of thought something like that might happen, but then I can just take this one. But yeah, it's like, I finished Pokemon, which, you know, like, if you're gonna talk to me about it, that's fine. I just don't want to spoil anyone who's like, oh, I'm here for something else, but I still haven't played Pokemon yet, so. Uh, I fought 10 overlevel Sinistee to get Staru Ledge. I found 999 coins to give Gimme Go, and I was like, okay, two ghost types, I can deal. But then I found a shiny Tattoo Giri. And like, I have to use that. So like, okay, two ghosts, two waters, I can do this. But then I ran across Shiny Mankey. And all of a sudden I got two waters, two fighting and three, get yeah, that, mm, that's some bad team comp, I think. But you could probably make it work if you really, really wanted to. Uh, crit charge on Doruman again. Fuck. So close. Okay. Um. I guess we can have you try your hand at Metal Greymon? Five attack boosts. Okay. Restore, revive, mm. Mm. Both of these aren't great. Sure. I still want to use uh, Citadel, so I have to drop something. And like, I work too hard to get Cerulean Legend Gold Engo. Two shinies I have to keep. So, like, only one can drop as my starter because it at least gets rid of the water. If I... Yeah, so, I mean, I'll, I'll be honest, Buzz. I think your first mistake was uh, going for Cerulean Ledge and Gold Engo. I think that was um, a bit much. It, of the two, I would say dropping Sarah Ledge would be better than Goldengo, only because Sarah Ledge, at least, like, you didn't put that much extra work into it. Like, you did. You did put in work, but it could have been worse. Boob missiles. Okay, so now if I go over here and grab this. Okay, I'm gonna go fight Ryuji. But it's also fire. Right, don't get me wrong. Like, I'm not saying it's an easy decision. I'm not saying you should absolutely do it. I'm just saying if you really wanted to hold on to your starter, Sever Ledge is probably the better choice. But your team comp overall is still kind of suffering. Oh, I'm at a Desolation Claw. Um, 7% of the damage as SP. I could Destruction Cannon. Okay. 
Actually, you're a vaccine. So... Data's good against... Right, yeah. Of all the shinies I had to find, why a Mankey? But Mankey is a good shiny. It's fine. I like Mankey. Oh my goodness. People, stop knocking me off of gyms. You're being rude. Which reminds me. It's Pokemon Go Community Day at 2 o'clock, your local time. It's uh, Chespin. They're finally doing the Gen 6 starters. So, if you want shiny Chespin, get on it. Uh, could I take... Yeah, we could take out Rise Grayamon. Three, four, five, six. They couldn't put just like attack up times six. And Kilomon, use Comet Hammer 2. Unimon, use. Uh, shit. Um. Sonic Void 2. Siakomon, just. Just try your best. Hey, your best did it. It was rough, but we got through it. Okay, Rapamon got two levels. Stingmon got one. What were we looking to get leveled up again? I think it was defense, but I don't know if we're going to make it. I'll have to double check. Vegemon got two levels. Good. Dekusmon got three levels. And Bakumon got seven. Hey, tell me about your friends. No. Those two are just like, I wanna know about I wanna know about their friends. I'm gonna message them. But they like both message me at the same time. Hey. The digital lab again. How are we doing over here? I'm gonna leave the Digilab for a moment. Just, just for a tick, that's all. Just go ahead and give that a minute. There it is. Wow, one whole case. Oh my goodness. Head back to the Digilab. I'm getting hungry already. I had breakfast. Had some eggs and sausage.
defense needs to be 95 for that. Again, we're getting there, but it's taking a little while. Defense at 90 for a cool bond? I don't think it's going to happen. Because Stingmon's pretty close to max level. And our defense is 68. So we need another, what, 20, 22 to be able to get to that? That's not going to happen. Uh, I also just don't have an XV mon. So, like, these two are not going to happen. Um, so, you know what? We're just going to Digivolve to Inframon. Because I want one. Granted, it's another virus, but it's fine. Hey, there's my boy. Okay, we are five over, so we gotta drop either Bakamon or Lekismon. I think we know who needs to go. Clear attack of memory. I don't think that's gonna happen. These are all some good Digimon, though. I like Beelzemon, I like Deboromon, and Venomitosmon's fine. What a looker. Anyway. Anyway. Oh, Inframon's still neutral, though. That's good. I actually thought Inframon would have been... Right, no, he's not... He's not neutral, he's unidentified, I think is actually the term. But in this game, that translates to neutral. So, that's good. Uh, let me double check these folks. Yeah, those are not out of the question. Still waiting on that intelligence 70. Maybe I should be training them instead. Oh, no, this is the training island. This is the island where everyone's having their training arcs. That's fine. Though. All right, let's leave. We're leaving the lab. Goodbye, lab. It's been a time. Ugh. What a new kid. Golemon! For fuck's sake! Hold on to your shit, please! Motherfucker! Gonna staple it to your forehead. No. And free gate out of here. Next time, I'm not going to give it back to him. I'm just going to keep it. It's going to be mine. If he can't hold on to it, he doesn't deserve it. Okay. So we got Legendary Digimon, Thief Who Doesn't Steal, and Mr. Nabbit. Now, I'm not sh like, this one's the easiest, but I don't know if there's one that'll, like, progress the story or not. I think yellow might just be, like, 
it might just be pure side content. Important, normal, digifarm. Okay. So I guess we'll take this one. Find my dream chief and learn the secret of how to obtain that glorious shining body. Oh, actually, this gives a farm expansion. I should have done this sooner. The client is Solarmon. I'll contact it and ask for details on the case. Hello! Are you the one who solves Digimon's problems? I haven't slept in days! You're not a counselor, but you'll listen to my problem, right? I'm Solarmon, pleased to meet you. Uh huh. I work in security for financial institution servers. I want to investigate the head of security secrets. No, I'm not trying to dig up dirt on my boss or anything like that. Quite the opposite. I look up to my boss, Gargermon Gold. Particularly his shining gold body. Just thinking about it makes me breathless. I wish I had a cool body like that. Oh, I'm starting to feel faint. Okay. Sorry, I'll get to the point. I want you to investigate the secret of Gargermont Gold's body. I must know how you can get such a magnificent body for myself. Actually, why don't I just ask him? I could just go up and ask something like that. Gargermont Gold is the big boss. Everyone looks up to him. I'm just a nobody. I get nervous just making reports to him for work. There's no way I can bring myself to ask something like this. Huh? A case is a case. Does that mean you'll do it? Yay, I'll send your location to the server where he is. Good luck. Thanks. Sudden domination battle. No, okay. Also, right before um, stream, I started listening to... So, if anyone's not familiar with the, like, Sonic redubbing thing, um... Pause. I know you watch or listen to it. It's like... Let me, let me look it up, because I don't want to get it wrong. Sonic redub. Snapcube. That's dumb. Snapcube like redub Sonic games. And it's really funny. I've listened to a lot of their stuff. The stuff I have listened to is really good. But today I was listening to them read a Sonic AI script, which I thought was fucking hilarious. Hey, over here! Stop! I think it's like Sonic Destruction. Look it up. It's so funny. Uh, the firewall, it's really strong. <laughs> the server was hacked a little while ago. Security was seriously stepped up after that. It might be a little difficult to get in. So I'm used to coming and going as I please. Sorry, I forgot to mention it. Hmm. You can handle it. That's a relief. Hmm. Make or delete floors. Power control. Oh, we can reduce encounters. Okay. Wall crack. Level three. Oh, it's just gone. Wow, you hacked the never. You hackers, ever see so amaze me. But if I hackers are service supposed to I'm supposed to protect I can't help but I'm feeling can't help but I can't help but feeling a little guilty okay that seems like a slight mistranslation there where's Garchermon hmm he should be here but he's always moving around the server to monitor security just walk around and you'll run into him soon enough wait we've been here already that, I've opened that chest before. 
Huh? You don't have that kind of time. You're right. It would be a disaster if an outsider was discovered in the server. A new security system is being tested on this server. There should be a short time lag before the administrator is notified. So this is the best chance of for moving around in the server. Although... Eh? Lure guards are wanting to come to you. Do you think you can do it? What? So after seeking undetected, you're just going to let them know you're here? That sounds dangerous. Beep boop 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 beep boop beep. The alarm! The security guards will be here soon! I'm wondering if this is maybe how we get the Digi Egg of Miracles? So I know you can Digivolve into Gold Gardramon with that, at least in other media. Intruder! Who are you? Wow, Gartramon Gold is really here! Huh? Solarmon? Did you arrive before me? Erm, um, I, erm. Um. What? You mean to say you deliberately attacked the server in order to lure me here? Yeah, just, just a little. You have a reason. It must be something malicious. Now come quietly, intruder! How do you, like, capture someone who's hacked into your system? Do you just, like... Do you just, like, hold their account hostage? And, like, maybe try to keep them from logging out? I don't know. Gold triangle. Mm, turbo Singer. And Infermon. Forbes Ghost Hacks. Yeah. Yeah, Spider Shooter. <coughs> oh, that wasn't too bad. Okay. Second verse, same as the first. One more time now. Hey, right, you know what I watched the other day? That I was like, you know, a little late to the party on. Considering the, you know, what it's, what it is. I finally watched the Guardians of the Galaxy uh, holiday special, which I actually thought was like really nice. Pretty funny too. If you haven't seen it and you like Guardians of the Galaxy, like definitely check it out. Oh, I didn't check Wasmon's defense. So you lured me here to defeat me, a cutting ploy indeed. No, that's not it. He's an intruder. What do you mean? Do you know this person? Oh, uh, I. Um. Blah, 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 blah. Hmm. You came to ask me something. So you break into the server, cause all this commotion. Just ask me a question. Yeah. If you're genuinely sorry, then I don't want to take things any further. But what is it that you're willing to risk capture? Just ask me. How do you get such a magnificent bod? You want to know the secret to my golden body? Why would a human want to know such a thing? Hmm. I see. So Solarman hired you to ask me. I'm sorry. I wasn't brave enough to ask you directly, so I hired this human to do it. I really look up to you. I want a magnificent golden body just like yours. So you wanted to know how to get a golden body? That's right. Sorry to disappoint you, but there is no secret. 
Huh? Not at all. I used to be a solar bond just like you. I simply worked hard as a security guard and one day I did evolve into my current form. So I just need to work hard? Come on, tell the truth. What do you mean by that? Do you think I'm just trying to make Solomon work harder? I understand your suspicion, but that's the truth. Mm. I still don't know if I believe it. Everyone makes mistakes. Don't worry about it. But I can't believe I lost to a human. I still have some way to go as head of security. If you were a real intruder, we would be in serious trouble right now. I must reevaluate my abilities and apply myself to make sure I'm up to the job. Wow, instead of punishing us, you're just putting yourself. You're so cool. Yeah, cool cool's the word. Thanks for talking to Gardramont Gold for me. He talks to me all the time now. I'm working much harder than before, and Gargemon Gold is being so supportive. Being supported by someone I admire so much is like a dream. He said I should be able to do job like him if I keep up the hard work. I had given up hope of ever being like him. But I know that he used to be a solar mod just like me is really encouraging. He doesn't just look impressive. He's so wise, too. I want to be just like him. I know that if I work hard enough, I'll have the same magnificent golden body one day. Thanks to you, my days are filled with hope again. I hope we get, like, another side quest that's, like, him. But, like, he's digivolved into something completely different, and he's like, Oh, no, this is the worst. I want my golden bod. Once I get my cool new golden body, I'll be sure to visit you and show it off. No. Oh. Hold on. I'll check the digital line first. Which of the following Digimon uses Oriental martial arts? Um. Doesn't Lobomon use like Kendo? Or Lobomon? I don't know if that's right or not. I don't know if Kendo is considered a form of martial arts or not. Probably not. But we went with it anyway. Farm expansion plugin. No plugin right now. Fucking Glade plugin shit. There we go. Sorry, just messaging Spooky, seeing how they're doing. I also, I woke up in the middle of the night last night with like a random idea for a meme. And um, I thought it was pretty funny. I'm gonna hopefully make it and um, put out into the wild later.
Hmm. If I have the money, I'm gonna buy two more sleuthing things. Wrong pipe. Oh, I'm gonna BRB. Okay, I'm back now. Sorry about that. Not as bad as last time, but like, ooh. Did not care for that. Have we not gotten any sellable? I guess we haven't. All right. <clears throat> Oh, uh, no. A Goonimon. Okay. I only remember a Goonimon in the anime, like, throwing fireballs, so... Oh, well. Let's, um, do we want to do Mr. Nabbit or Thief Who Doesn't Steal? Let's see. Aquamarine. Find Mr. Nabbit, the mystery person. Yeah, we'll go with, we'll go with Mr. Nabbit. <clears throat> Rumors of Mr. Nabbit. Never heard of him. Is he different from Eden's Mr. Nabbit? And the client's name is Vice President of the Golden Dawn? This case is a complete mystery. But I haven't asked to find Mr. Nabbit, so I'll start by collecting information about him. Seems like he's appeared out of, uh, around here, so I'll ask around. Isn't he the guy that we, like, did already meet? He's the one where you, like, Okay, then. I meant to talk to you. And you got nothing for me. What was that saying? <clears throat> He's the guy that like, gives you free medals or whatever. Hello there, do you want to ask me something? Mr. Navit. He's something of an urban legend. I've never seen him around here. What should I have today? I hot or ice? Decision decisions. Mr. Nabbit. Never heard of Mr. Nabbit. Is that a new type of coffee? No. No, it's not. What? No social media, Mr. Nabbit. I know, that weird, uh, that weirdo wearing a Mr. Nabbit head, right? I saw him in front of the cell phone shop. Posted online, everyone went crazy for it. <laughs> According to the information, Mr. Nabbit has been sighted around here. <laughs> Ooh. I don't think he'll be easy to find. Um... What the? There's something here? What the fuck? It's doing something! What? What is that? I'm scared, mommy! It made him cry! What did you do to my son? 
She yelled at it. It knelt down. Okay. Uh. It looked at me. What the? It's coming right at me. It's following me. What is happening? Oh, hi to Hootie. Oh God, it really is following me. Leave me alone. Get away from me. Here at last, you shouldn't follow me inside. Arg. Oh. Mr. Navit, is it really him? They say anyone who sees him gets overcome by fear and joy. Is this really happening? It looks like Mr. Navit, but it's not Mr. Navit. Yeah, it's just like the eyewitness accounts say. It's really him. He gives me the creeps. His arms and legs are human. It looks like someone deliberately tried to make a terrible costume. What are you? Why are you here? Hey, May, cut that out. It's just someone dressed in a costume to promote Eden. Let them go on with their job. Then why did they chase me? No, it's not. That's just how it looks. You don't fool me. It's got tape on it. You're an alien, aren't you? I know it. Show your true form. No, it's a person. There's clearly someone inside. You're wasting your breath, Monaka. There's no stopping me when she gets like this. Uh, Tagnus Sula Cosmota. Tagna Sula Cosmota. Ba weep, grana weep, nitty bong. Um, hey, that's the spell for summoning aliens. Cool. Huh? Oh, yeah. In that case, Vinna Digas Mandil Cast Kina Vigas Dandil Mast. Whoa, what's that? my order from Starbucks. She's so full of surprises. She's making a fool of herself. What's the matter? Are you in a bad mood? Oh, someone's jealous. Huh? Of what? Sorry to disturb you. What do you want? Nothing. It's just that it's gone. Arg. No, Mr. Navit. This is the breakthrough we've been waiting for. How can we let it slip through our fingers? Go after it, hurry. You too, go. Now. Do we get it? Stop it. I don't feel like, uh, I don't feel that way about Kenji. You're always making fun of me, Lily. I'm looking for him. I hear he's beside at the shoe store. Okay. The time is becoming fast. Uh, the, because, it's fast becoming the latest urban legend, Niki Bukuro. Hmm? Who's so eager to see him? Us, of course. I have to get a look at him. I wonder where he is. Is there something strange going on at the arcade? So jealous of May just now, weren't you? Go on, admit it, Monaka. Oh, Mr. Nebbit, I think he's through the cell phone store. Conflicting arguments. Maybe he's hiding somewhere. I'll ask around and see if there's any witnesses. Something like that. Roasting. 
yeah. Y'all don't seem like you're helping much. Give me you again. No. Go back to the back to the cell phone store. It's no use. It's long gone. I'll go back to the others. Hmm. I can't believe not one of you was able to catch it. Sorry, May. It's strange. It was a dead end. Huh. Let's sigh. You're taking this too hard. Don't worry about it. Yeah, we witnessed an urban legend with our own eyes. We'll catch you next time. Don't say that. You'll just get her even more worked up. Hmm. You're right. We can't give up now. One day, I'll reveal Mr. Nava's true identity. Okay. Wait up, May! I guess we're done for today. I've got to get to work. See ya. I let May down again. I'm going home. Huh? You're... Ah, oh, we've met before. The Synchronicity guy. That's me. That butterfly on your clothes. Looks like the Hootie butterfly I saw on the bulletin board. Ah, oh, I didn't even realize that was a butterfly. Are you with Hootie? Did you accept my case? It's me, Vice President of the Golden Dawn. My nickname must have made it difficult to guess it was me. The Golden Dawn was a British secret society founded in the 19th century. What? Even Aleister Crowley, known as the wickedest man in the world, was briefly a member. What? Uh, their teaching centered on the Kabbalah and their hierarchy is was based on the Kabbalah's tree of life, in fact. I don't need a has history lesson, man. I just want my... I just want my treasure. My treasure. My reward. I, I accidentally... I subconsciously read the word treasure there. I'm sorry. Western history is a treasure trove of occult knowledge. Once I get talking about it, I just can't stop. I talked about it with May on the phone for more than six hours last week. Damn. You were looking for me. I thought you were bringing Mr. Navit. No, he was following me for some reason. Huh? Why would he follow you? Actually, seeing as I have some synchronicity with you, maybe he'll follow me as well. I have to let May know. Thanks for the info. Okay. So, maybe it's you, or Chitose, or Ryuji, or Erika. I guess we'll see. I'll be sure to send payment! It sure was a bizarre case, but I somehow managed to complete it. Time to head back to Hudi. <gasps> I had a feeling I was being watched. Must have just imagined it. I see that guy over there. Weird, but all right. Something didn't feel right at the time. It was vague, but I definitely felt it. It was like I'd gotten a glimpse of something extraordinary. And that guy's gone. That was him. And now he's here! Ah, uh, three whole cases. Wait, there was another digi line? Huh. Interesting. Time is it? It's almost 11.30? Okay. Right here, let me enclose this. Here's the PC. Oh, 
Um, yeah, did you lab? So we probably got some investigation to do. Investigate. Another 30 minutes. Okay. I'm still ready to go back to sleep. Diatrimon or Diatrimon? Something like that. Uh, correct it young at heart. It's another domination battle against probably those like children again. Um, behind teach them a lesson, eat them cool down a little. I think I've done this as well. And we've definitely done the anti Agumon League. So, fuck that. Thief who doesn't steal. Share a little bit. Getting all of us together for a job, that's pretty extravagant. Who's the client? Yucker, me, aqua the aquarium in Ikibukuro. So the client is a fish? Of course not. It's the aquarium manager. It's a theft case. It seems some thieves have been breaking in. Too bad. Just sounds like an ordinary case. I'm so upset there isn't a female protagonist in this game. Me too. I know we've talked about it before because like I, I legit thought there was a female protagonist, but no, it's just, it was just Erica I was looking at. Too bad. It just sounds like an ordinary case, but theft? Surely there's more of a police matter. The police have passed on this case to us. So it's not just an ordinary case? Maybe someday we'll get another Digimon story game over here in the West. And I'll have another female pro tag. Uh, Matsuyo, she's a detective, right? I see you're all here. Thanks for agreeing to this. Let me introduce the client. This is Mr. Mizushita. Manager of the Ikibukuro Aquarium. Keep in mind that everything we discuss must be kept absolutely confidential. It's gonna kind of warm my room. Give me one sec. Gonna crack my windows a little bit. It gets too spicy in here. Then I'll explain the situation. Fish must have been going missing from our tanks every night for some time now. Because of the cunning methods employed by the thieves, it takes more than a month to notice that anything was wrong. You're stealing fish? Hang on a sec. Gonna ask you something first? Yes, what? What fish have been stolen? For starters, sea bream, flounders, and seahorses. Well, maybe the thieves want to start their own aquarium. Chitose. What the fuck? This is no laughing matter. You should take it more seriously. Hey. You laugh and get, uh, and he gets mad at me. Yep. That's how our dynamic works. What else was stolen? Some sharks. 
Uh, those sharks are huge. How could they steal them? The sharks are aquarium or small species. They're only about 30 centimeters long. And even though they were small sharks, they don't sound very scary. Clownfish, conger eels, or conger eels? Jellyfish, sardines, spider crabs, and even penguins and sea otters have been stolen. <laughs> that many. Let me see, what else? Uh, what about cod? Were any cod stolen? No, we don't have any cod in the aquarium. Oh, I see. Did you want to eat them? Erica, the issue is it was stolen. How can you not notice all those animals missing for a whole month? Um, well... The thieves, they employ a very cunning method. Oh, uh, yeah, right. Are you sure it's not because your old geezers aren't up to the job? Wow. I... I don't know what to say to that. Hey, show some respect for your elders. Hackers rely on information to do their job, so you should listen to everything the client has to say. Isn't that right, Ryuji? That's right. Sorry for the interruption. Please continue. We don't know why, but the thieves always return the animals to where they belong after a few hours. Uh huh? What the? So the exhibits are stolen during the night and returned before we open the next day. More specifically, they're usually returned after about an hour. That's why we didn't notice for over a month. I can see why. How? Pardon me? She means, how did you eventually notice that was going on? Oh, I see. Unless something happens, the CCTV camera footage is wiped every month without being watched. A member of our staff noticed it was happening while erasing the footage. It showed some masked men carrying away the tank at lightning speed. Then they returned in about an hour and put them back in exactly the same place. Right down to the millimeter. Interesting. That sure is strange. Why would they do such a thing? That's what makes this case so bizarre. They risk being cut just to return what they took. Isn't the police's job to investigate this? Ordinarily, yes, but my superiors have been at lodger... lodger heads? About how to handle it. I'll spare you the details, but this case isn't technically classified as theft. Legally, Theft is the intention of permanently deprive the owner of property. If that can't be proven, it can't be considered theft. Okay, but like... <sighs> Here's the thing, right? Here's the thing. If I was to go to court, right? If I stole something, like if I took someone's car, let's say and we went to court over it and i was just like i had every intention of bringing it back immediately i don't think i would get the uh fucking i keep wanting to say the council that's not right the jury i don't think i would get the jury to side with me on that one if i'm being honest the perpetrator's behavior of always returning the exhibits means that the owner isn't permanently deprived of his property. Of course, if we knew who they are, we could nail them for trespassing on private property, but trespassing cases aren't a high priority. My superiors have decided that we can't spare the resources to investigate the case right now. Come off it. That just sounds like an excuse for being lazy. Chitose, we're getting paid. Shut up. <laughs> Jeez. That's a bit of an exaggeration. Detective Matayoshi can't be everywhere at once. Uh, it's okay, Ryuji. I've got a thick skin. That why I restored... Okay. That's... it's. That's why I restored to... I've resorted to bringing Mr. 
Mizoshida here to meet you in secret. The aquarium is actually scheduled to undergo a major renovation soon. If word of this gets out, we might end up losing our grant and might even have to shut down permanently. I suppose it would be risky to give a grant to an aquarium where thieves can come and go at will. The CCTV footage is evidence of trespassing. If you think the grammar mistakes are bad in this game, oh boy, way to play survive. Oh dear. I do still, I do still need to play survive. I just, I've been so focused on playing Pokemon as much as possible. I just haven't popped it into my Switch yet. I feel bad too, cause like my parents got it for me and my mom's been asking like, have you played your new game yet? Have you played your new game yet? And I keep saying like, I'll do it eventually. Uh, if you can find out who they are, I'll arrest. Please tell us everything. Uh, tell us everything else you know. Then we'll decide whether or not to take the case. The thieves always make their move during gaps in the security guard's patrol schedule. Of course, we change the routes and handover times every day. Even so, they always know the times when there are the fewest guards. How about security? Do you have motion sensors or infrared beams? Thieves to save our security system. So the alarm never goes off. Is some crappy old security system? Far from it. It's brand new. One of the thieves must be a highly skilled hacker. I heard there are lots of top-notch hackers in Eden. You don't suspect us, do you? Of course not. Matsuyoshi told me all about you. He said you wouldn't be capable of something like this. How nice of him to say that. I didn't mean it that. I just meant you wouldn't be capable of committing a crime like that. Otherwise, we wouldn't be asking you for help. For your help. Isn't that right, Mr. Mizushida? Right, sorry, I phrased that badly. I would really like Hudi to uncover the truth and catch the cru uh, culprits. So what's it gonna be? Meh. God, it, I could just say like, nah, let's not do it. It's whatever, no, we'll take the case. Then let's take it. I'm a little curious to find out exactly what's going on. I knew you'd take it. Thanks. Thank you. Let me just check two things. Every single stolen exhibit was was returned, right? <clears throat> yes, I checked with our keeper. Nothing is missing. And finally, was anything added? Added? Please check for any unfamiliar decorations, stones, or anything else. I will. What should I do if I find something? Contact us straight away. Make sure you don't touch it. Understood. Thanks again. Then I'll leave you to it. I'll leave it to you. Sean can read? Who says he can't? Okay, let's go over the case. Every night, a group of masked men evade the security guards and steal one of the aquarium's exhibits. Then they come back and return it soon after. Hmm, I see. What do you mean? Do you know who they are? No idea. How about you, new boy? Maybe the criminals love fish? I saw enough to just look at them? They want to swim with them? Then why go to the trouble of returning them? Maybe they realize they're too difficult to keep? You have to control the water temperature, water quality, stuff like that. It's difficult even for a professional. So the next day they steal different fish. Within an hour realize they're also difficult to keep and then return them and repeat that 30 times? You have to be really stupid. Or there's something we're missing. In any case, we need more clues. I agree. Hang on a sec. I've connected the aquarium server. I'll take a look at the security system logs. Hmm. Found something. It looks like the thieves accessed it via cyberspace. They have deleted the logs, but I saw enough to stop me. 
They've been careful, but not careful enough. There are still traces of deleted logs. You should do it. Damn, they've covered their tracks. Chitose, forward the data to me. I think I know how to uncover their route. Okay, you take things from here. Once we know where we where they access the server from, Sean and I will hack them. That sound good to you? Yeah, okay. I've got the address. Got the aquarium backdoor URL. Great, let's go. Be careful. Did she say that to Ryuji? I'm sure she did. There's no way she would say it to a boring non-main character character like me. Tokomon's max level. Oh, that Tokomon. Oh, that Tokomon. Damn, you really just like <laughs> don't have cam. Uh, you know what? Hold on. Tokomon, right? I believe you're on Farm Island 2. Um. Feed. Cam plus one. I can do those three cams at 11%. Do I want, do I want to feed it more so Sister Mon Blanc is available? Or do I not care? Patamon, Falcomon, Hawkmon. Do I have any of them right now? I don't think so. Yeah, we'll just go with these three. That should be fine, right? And we got Falcomon anyway. God damn it. All right. Ugh. Oh, Jackmon's also maxed out. Cam ten percent on Drachmon. Yeah, we can we can do that actually. Let's go find Drachmon. Major cam up, big cam up. Let's try the exciting meat. Okay, apparently I'm just wasting the exciting meat because it decided to use a fucking treadmill right away. Why are you not eating? I don't think that was enough. I might be able to buy more from here. I can buy exciting meat, which we already deemed it doesn't eat for some reason. Cam's at 9%. 
Can I buy Digimi from somewhere? Okay, so apparently basic Digimeet just refills automatically. And I know I can buy the exciting stuff, so I don't mind, like, trying that again. Oh, I see. Three minutes and we get one more. Okay, I understand. Eat. Fucking... How about you? Will you eat this? No? Why is no one eating exciting meats? Okay, so exciting meat just has a really low chance of working. And of course, I try it one more time and we're good. Okay. I really hope we get Sister Monseal now because if not, I kind of wasted a lot of meats. That's the exciting part. Don't you patronize me. <laughs> uh, do we have a Sang Loopmon already? I thought we did. Or it might have just been an enemy one. No, it was just an enemy one. Okay. How about rare mon? I'm pretty sure we had a rare mon. Nope, we didn't have a rare mon either. Okay. Cool. Hey, we got her anyway. Cool. Okay. There's an awakened version. Ooh. Okay. Falcomon. Yeah. Cam twenty five per cent. Cam's at two per cent. Oh, it ate one right away. All right. We still need to eat another one though, so. Nope. 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 You jerk. All right. Best meat. Plus five. Okay. Yeah, I, I, the site I looked it up on real quick was like, yeah, you should just save scum for that. And like, I would if I wasn't streaming. Cause that just sounds boring. Lalamon. I actually think I have Vegemon, Woodmon, and Sunflowmon right now. I'll double check, but Woodmon, Sunflowmon, Vegemon. So Lalamon, you're just gonna be Togemon. Okay. Cyclomon. Ooh. Ooh, Elecamon though. Could. Could become Garurumon. Actually, no. Because I use all my exciting meat. So it can't be Garurumon. So we're just going to Digivolve to whatever else there is. I forgot that there was a recolor of Numemon. I know it's like Garymon, but it just sounds like Garymon to me. 
Garuamon Black. Neat. Raptor Jermon, Sukamon, Numemon, Mudfridgemon. To level 30, you can go to level 49. Level 30, level 30. Actually, one more level for Greymon and uh, be able to digivolve into any one of these fellas. Oh, back to Falcomon, and that was farm two. Can you get up to level 30? You can. Intel okay, max SP 60 and intelligence 75. SP is already 55, intelligence 71. So Woodmon can in theory become Talmon as well. So uh Sunflowmon, Growlmon, Geograymon, Frigimon can already become Monzemon. Neat. Colemon. I know it's Celamon. Okay, both of these is hack 75. Your attack is 48. So we need 25, 6, 7. So in 21 levels, we need 27 points in attack. I don't think that's going to happen. I really don't. So we're going to go with Datamon or Wisemon. So let's see what happens. Wisemon. I would have preferred Datamon, but I really don't care either way that much. Airdramon, I guess he dramon, SP70. That could happen. And Cam 50%, that cannot happen. Not at the moment. And intelligence still needs to get up to 70. Okay. Okie dokie then. Still working on defense. Still working on defense and intelligence and SP. Basically just working on levels at this point. Same thing with you. Actually, oh, no. Attack 75. Can you even get up there? Yes. Okay. And if I'm on, you just gotta, just gotta work it. Just gotta work it. Okay. That was fun, wasn't it? I do gotta remember every week to actually like use my Digimeat though. Okay. So we are currently working on that one. Pardon me. You think we're gonna find a lot of like fish dwelling Digimon here? Interesting. Okay, we're gonna turn on acceleration. Farm expansion, expansion plugin. All right. Maybe I go install that now. <laughs> kind of feel like I bullied them, but okay. And Fermat needs the levels now, so. Plus, if there's gonna be a lot of Atomamon, I might as well convert it. Expansion A Farm good with a treadmill. I don't have anything else, right? No. I don't think I can afford anything else. I could be wrong. 
Nope. I literally never use those. Uh, I don't think I need these if I have that. I feel like I should just have more than what I have right now, you know? Escape from battle, go home. Slightly reduces one Digimon's enhanced intelligence. Why would I want to reduce their intelligence? I don't think any Digimon Digivolution is like, you need to have less intelligence. Oh well. Hello? Seen you and me. I don't get along with the others yet. Any ideas? Be brave, try speaking to them. Also, don't steal all the snacks, it's snack time. That's how I made friends. I was not taking their food. And that was it. Spooky's going wild on their meme channel. Okay, let's push the button. Oh, um. Power. No? Root. Oh, okay. When it said floors, I literally thought it meant like the entire floor, not just like, oh, the, we open up a path. Oh, this is just tedious, though. I realize it's gonna be like a puzzly thing, but it still feels just. Ugh. Ugh. Blech. Bow. 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 Um. Are we or are we not in their mainframe? Look, there's someone there. Is it a girl? It's Marine Angemon. Welcome to my aquarium. I'm Minamo Takisuse. I'm surprised you found this place. Are you the police? We're like detectives. It doesn't matter who you are. You've got nothing on me. Can we ask you some questions? What is this place? What are you doing here? As you've come all this way, I'll give you a special tour of my aquarium. You shouldn't answer either of my questions. Have you noticed? This place looks exactly like the Ikibukuro Aquarium. Yeah. Yeah, no, I, I saw. How observant. It's a perfect digital copy of the aquarium's building, facilities, and animals. It's almost complete. Hee hee hee. I see. So you did it to create this place? But did you really need to resort to theft? You can find you can find lots of similar data for fish and buildings on the net. Good morning, Luke. Or afternoon. Actually it's almost noon here too. So good evening, I guess. You don't get it. Similar isn't good enough. It has to be a perfect reproduction. The building and decor can be recreated from photos. But how the animals look and move can't be scanned from ordinary photos or videos. They have some very rare fish. There's no information anywhere about the types of tanks and equipment they use. And it's not as if I can go up to them and ask to borrow their precious fish and equipment, right? More like evening? Yeah, 
It, it is it is evening. I see. So you steal them, copy them, and then return them? Steal? Please don't use that word. I just borrowed them and scanned them with a 3D scanner. No one could accuse me of stealing. It seems so, but you are suspected of trespassing on private property. I hate that. In the virtual world, people are free to go anywhere they like. The real world is so full of restrictions. That's also not true. I'm sure there's plenty of spaces in Eden where people are not free to go, so. I go as a Saturday morning cartoons. Oh, they go. I'm doing a lot of side missions today, but, but they go. Although you're not quite right. I didn't actually trespass. What do you mean? Breaking into the aquarium, finding the exhibit, removing it, and then returning it safe and sound, all within a short space of time. I hired a team of international super thieves. They didn't leave any evidence, and I haven't committed any crime. You just admitted to one. Did you hire someone to do the hacking as well? I asked a Digimon and a hacker to help with that. Of course, I didn't do anything myself, and any evidence is long gone by now. The most difficult part was scanning everything perfectly in the short time between acquiring the exhibits and returning them. I bought an entire studio for that. So it's just a very expensive hobby? It takes more than money. I had to be smart, too. And that's why you'll never pin anything on me. I haven't caused anyone any trouble, even you. And look, this place is almost finished. My own private aquarium. Well, I have to hand it to you. This place certainly looks beautiful. Thank you. That makes me so glad to hear. But it doesn't sit right with me. It's also the ugliest thing I've seen. In a sense. Ugly? What do you mean? Yeah, you spent a lot of money, but you didn't get your hands dirty. You got other people to do it for you. So much for the perfect crime. Well, what? The law can't bring you to justice, but unluckily for you, we aren't the law. We're hackers. We'll make sure you're punished. This aquarium will never be completed. He's just straight up just gonna be like, I'm gonna fuck your shit up. I'm not a cop. <laughs> Deal with it. Hmm. That's too bad. Looks like I'm going to have to dispatch my first visitors. I knew she seemed too willing to talk. She never intended to let us leave here. I mean, she might have. Wow, a Silamon and a Seedramon. Who would have seen it coming? Oh, they're both data. Okay, um... We'll just... We'll just underfall. I thought that might do more damage. Okay, that's alright though. That's okay. Um... We'll see if we can take down Seelamon first. Nope. Unless we have Spider Shooter. Defense down, and also it's knocked out. Oh no! Anyway. Mm, turbo Stinger. And down it goes. Alrighty then. Yeah, last one is such a high level, and yet, like, it's still not high enough. I... I've always wanted to live in an aquarium. What? Especially that aquarium. It's in a tall building, like a seabed for the sky. So you have some attachment to that aquarium? Yes. So many memories. I went all the time as a child, at least once a week. Re that's a lot of money. 
It's also where I met my uh, went on my first date. But they're going to have a major innovation soon. Did you hear about that? Yes, we did. I was shocked when the final design was announced. It looks more like a nightclub or casino. They're going to have a pop group. They're going to have pop groups singing with tropical fish. Don't you think that's tacky? Um, I mean, both of these sentences are true. It is tacky, but it's also how things are now. We'll agree with her, though. That makes me feel a bit better. At least someone agrees with me. I thought about starting a petition to keep the aquarium as it is, but they probably wouldn't take any notice. Things never go my way in the real world. So I decided to preserve it by myself. Just as it, uh, as it had always been, and just how I remember it. I understand how you feel. I kept trying to think of ways to make the aquarium mine. When all said and done, you didn't intend to cause any trouble. You just wanted to recreate the aquarium for yourself, correct? That's right. But we can't just look the other way. Memories aren't about preserving data. There's something you keep inside you for the rest of your life. Maybe you're right. If you're going to report me, just do it. <laughs> I mean, as long as something's stolen and she's not going to do it again, I would just be like, eh. Just be on your way. Just know that if it happens again, then... There's going to be issues. Looks like you got this case all wrapped up. The aquarium will send payment. Huh? What's the matter, Ryuji? Why the long face? There's something bothering me about this case. I hope it turns out to be nothing. Hmm? By the way, I met the perpetrator. We're not going to ask him what he thinks is wrong. We're just going to be like, oh, by the way, we're going to talk to someone else. I can't go into detail, but she's the only daughter of a very wealthy man. He recently passed away and left his entire for- Oh, okay, that makes sense then. Her father dead? Her father's dead? And recently? But she hired people to steal the exhibits and hack the security. Surely there's no evidence. Exactly. That's why the aquarium has dropped a complaint. It receives extremely rare creatures from other aquariums and research institutes around the world for special exhibitions and the like. Any rumors of security problems will soon be put an end to that. Now we know who is behind it all. After being arrested, she uh, promised she'd never do it again. The aquarium is happy to leave it at that. So... She'll be released tomorrow. Sir! Calm down, Ryuji. I know how you feel, but we have no other choice. No, it's hurt. No actual damage was caused. I'm sure you agree she's learned her lesson. No, I don't. How can you release her so- I feel like he's acting very angry for no reason. We just had a conversation with her. She clearly learned her lesson and is not going to do it again. And Ryuji is still just like, but she has to pay. She's not being charged. We can't just hold her. If not tomorrow, she'll be out in a few days. Call the aquarium manager right now. What? Why? I'm going to the aquarium. Wait here. What's his deal? Just kind of exploded out of nowhere. Jeez. Ah, uh, Ryuji, Matsuyoshi, did you find out what you- did you find what you were looking for? Ryuji was right. We found a nasty little surprise. I couldn't believe it. What did you find? Um, I don't feel comfortable saying it in front of Erika. It's fine. She's a hacker just like us. Plastic explosive set to be detonated remotely at any time. Okay. Alright. Yeah, that's probably a little more urgent than just like, you know, she gets released. But at the same time, I feel like his initial 
His initial reaction was a bit much, even if it led to something that we need to take care of. They were attached to the undersides of all the tanks that were that we returned. They're small, but detonating them all at once would level the place. Explosives? But why? Good question. How did you know they'd be there? I suspected it right from the start. She created an exact copy of the aquarium in her own private cyberspace. It was what she confined. Uh, it was as if she combined space and time itself, as well as herself. I had to ask myself what someone in that mindset would do once they accomplished everything they set out to do. Tell us, what does she intend to do? Blow the place up. I feared she'd try to keep the aquarium all to herself. By destroying the one in the real world? Even though she knew it's about to be renovated? Don't look so worried. Unless she actually pressed the detonator, everything I just said is nothing more than a theory. We don't have any evidence that she planned the explosives. Once again, we can't pin anything on her. But now she's probably moved the virtual aquarium to a small server and disappeared off somewhere far, somewhere far away from here. I'm annoyed that we can't hold her to account, but at least nothing will happen to the aquarium if she presses the detonator now. The only positive is that no one's been hurt in all this. It's been an unusual case. Nothing will happen to the aquarium if she presses the detonator. However, there might be a catastrophic, catastrophic result somewhere else instead. Somewhere else? What do you mean? Oh god, he hacked it so the, the virtual aquarium would explode instead and delete all the data. Oh my god, he's fucking evil. Memories aren't about preserving data. There's something you keep inside you for the rest of your life. What did he mean by that? Nonsense. That's where I'm going to stay for the rest of my life. It may be missing a few finishing touches, but it's all mine. When I press this detonator, my aquarium will be the only one like it in the world. It was gonna be the only one like it in the world after the renovations anyway. Your logic is so flawed. More flawed than Ryuji just being like, yeah, I know there are bombs there. <laughs> I do not know which one's worse. Deletion program activated. All data in the cyberspace will be erased. Please log off immediately. I repeat. Deletion program activated. All data in the cyberspace will be erased. Huh? Well, what's going on? All data in the cyberspace will be erased. Erased? How? Why? No, my aquarium. So at the end of the day, all she did was pay off a lot of really bad people. Imagine if clicking the button more made the erasure even faster. It might have. Who knows? He wants to know what happened to that girl. Okay, I'll let you in on something. When we went to see her, I installed a program to delete all data in that cyberspace. I linked the execution key to the detonation signal for the explosive she planted in the real aquarium. That's all I did. Yeah, I kind of figured that much, Ryuji. I mean, apparently my character didn't, but... Memories aren't about preserving Deva. data. You keep them inside you. Maybe I'm naive, but because of this high-tech age we live in, that's what I truly believe. Do you think I got through to her? I wonder if she could resist pressing the detonator. But what happened to her? If she's in the cyberspace, you delete. One whole case, wow. But that's the opposite of what Erica's treatment is? Yeah? I mean like, 
It is, but they're doing it because she can't keep the memory. It's, I don't know. It's weird. We got an Aquamarine. Anti-Devamon League. Oh my. Devamon, Ogremon, and Kuwagamon. Let's go have them look for more, I guess. I mean, yeah, Erica's treatment's like weird, but it's also his sister. So like, I don't think he cares that much. I guess the BBS doesn't have any particularly important cases right now. Maybe it's time to ask Mirai what's afoot. I'm gonna save. What was that? What was that Digiline? Maybe I'll become a computer whiz if a hacker can teach me. You're one, right? No. Why would I be a hacker? I don't understand. See, we got like 45. I mean, I don't even have to end at a certain time today. It's not like I'm going anywhere, so. We could probably do the next major story hurdle if we need to. Oh my, look at that face. Maybe lost. I think so. You know, there's some kids arguing about something in Eden's community area. Sounds like a girl is driving a boy crazy with her unreasonable unre demands. Maybe you can help him. Oh, it looks like it's happening again. The girl in front of the escalator on the first floor in Nakano Broadway. Do you know her? Do come again if you lose your way. Interesting. So, when I did play just like a tat. No. I think, no, I think I did do it on stream, like, very last thing. We saw, um, Yuko in Nakano, and I was just like, nope, story, stay away from me. So let's go check the community area first. Community area. Huh? But I want to go! Don't be so stubborn. You know you can't. But everyone else in my class is going. I want to go too. There's nothing I can do. Now stop being so silly. Who are you calling silly? You're the stupid one. Stop crying. I don't know what more I could do. It looks like our brother and sister are having a fight. Sniff, sniff. I could go if I had a ticket. There must be a way to get one. Lurk. Okie dokie, Luke. A ticket. Where'd they fucking go? Hmm. Well, I guess I left. Can I get a ticket in the real world? Hmm. Can I buy a ticket here? There's a shop. Is that the little girl? No, that's a frivolous girl. They just happen to look exactly the same. I think it's the same thing with the boy over here, too. I think that might be him. But that's a scampering boy.
Hmm. No one here. You know, it's another thing I haven't actually checked since we got it. Is the um thing where you can like buy Digimon. Programming now. I also don't know if I've actually looked through this area yet. Let me let me take a peek. Okay, I think I did get something there. I want to climb on those boxes so bad. Game, let me climb on things. Might be a nuisance. Grr. Okay. I don't know where to go to can like continue that. Maybe it's tied to the um, one with Yuko, so. Let me check that thing I mentioned first. Digimarket, that's the one. Okay. That's not bad. Um, I'm not gonna buy any of them, but like, you know, we got some okay mods in here. Also, I think I gotta use the bathroom real bad, so I'm gonna go do that. I will be right back again. I'm back now. I have no idea how long I was gone, but I'm sorry if it took a while. Uh, I used the restroom and I got lunch sorted with my family. So, yeah. Let's see, where are we at? Welcome back, thank you. Uh, welcome back to you too, Luke. If you are indeed unlurking. Check that posture. I I just sat down. I don't think my, my posture can get any better than than where it's at when I first sit down, but okay. Well uh There we go. I guess I can put my seat up one more. Oh god, that's oh that's tight. Okay. Alright, one new case added. A treasured smile. I want to take it to the Eden upgrade preview. And you get it for me. We get a lot of hacker points. I get no yen. Tobu cat. What the fuck is a Tobu catmon? <laughs> a case to get a ticket for the Eden upgrade preview. I'll we'll start by searching online. Hmm. There aren't any hits for an Eden upgrade preview. It's just information about past upgrades. There's nothing about an upcoming preview. Is there even going to be an upgrade? I think it'd be best to talk to the client in person. <laughs> oh, are you the handyman? Have you brought my ticket? Uh, there isn't gonna be a preview. Is a preview even real? Of course it is. It's happening soon. My friend's mom works for the company that runs Eden. She told me about it on down low. I heard some people have got tickets already. I don't know what you're talking about. It doesn't sound like tickets are available to the public. It might be difficult to get one. It won't be easy to get one, right? Um, I just love Eden so much. And I heard it look, it'll look it look even better after the upgrade. So I want to see it as soon as possible. I asked my big brother, but he got mad and said it's impossible to get a ticket. He called me stubborn and stormed off. But I want to go so bad. Hmm. But you can't. He'll try. Thank you. No promises, though. I was thinking of paying you with a Digimon medal. Once you're so kind. I'll give you something special, too. <gasps> Wooper from the Salamander and Friends series. It's my favorite stuffed toy. It's so cute. It'll love like Wooper, the Pokemon. I, I mean, I don't really need that. I appreciate it. Now that I've taken this case, how should I go about getting a ticket that's not even available to the public? Ryuji and Chitose aren't here. I'll ask Erica.
Hmm. Can't believe she's not in her room. I'll check the cafe. It's Erica. Looks like she's putting something in the drinks. Drip, drip, drip. Drip, 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 drip. Drip, 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 drip. I don't know what it is, but it looks like she's adding too much of it. What are you looking at? Ah! A ticket for the upgrade preview. Oh yeah, that kid's case. Why did you accept that one? Isn't the payment just a medal? Uh, I want a medal. Making a girl smile is reward enough for me. I want a medal. I can kind of see the appeal of collecting medals. It's none of my business, but wouldn't the ticket cost more than the medal? Going through so much trouble for a medal just doesn't seem worth it. Huh? The medal isn't the only payment. She also give you a stuffed toy of Wooper, the Salamander from Salamander and Friends. Well, that changes everything. You absolutely must complete this case. Huh? You can keep the medal, but let me have the toy. Huh? Come on, it's Wooper. It was only available in the in the version of the Salamander Friends series. The Memetons on the terminal are part of the same series, but I was pretty late getting into it, so I couldn't get any Wooper. It was a limited edition. You can't even find it in Nakano Broadway. If it was that popular, you'd be able to find it. I'm sorry. But, like, it, it's true. <laughs> Whatever. I've made up my mind. I'm going to help you. Huh? I've got other things to do, but this is a Wooper we're talking about. They can wait. We just need to find a ticket, right? Let's get started. Hee <laughs> hee. I knew this day would come. I've even decided a code name. Cognitum. Or decided a name. I got it from the phrase, phrase cognito ergo sum. What? Why are you speaking Latin now? It looks like there will be an upgrade soon. Hmm. You couldn't find anything about it online? Not with a quick search, no. You search a few dozen sources at most, and only in the open space, right? You need to search thousands of sources to find the real juicy info. After all, billions of people exchange information, even. I found something. There's a rumor about a seller with tickets for the preview. Ah! Oh. Looks like he's in Ikebukuro. Let's go. Uh, okay. I thought, like, Yuko would just give us the tickets, but... All right. Actually, let me check the digi line real quick. Okay. Investigations, net cases, and items, huh? It take a while, but I'll do my best. I kind of thought we might have gotten a message while I was gone, so. Ikebukuro. Are we in? Ikebukuro? It seems like we are. <gasps> Shoes. I'm surprised you recognize me as a ticket seller. Those clothes. Are we with Hudi? I suppose funny information like this is all in a day's work for someone like you. But those preview tickets are rare and they don't come cheap. They must be really expensive. What can we do? Buy them? Ask him if he's got a list of people who have bought tickets preview tickets from him. Hmm? Information on my customers. Of course I have info. Most of them are regulars. Oh, I see what you're thinking. You want to track them down and try to negotiate with them for a ticket. That wouldn't be good for business. Sorry, I can't give out information on my customers. And hacking won't work either. I write everything down on paper and carry it around with me. Just to prevent hackers like you from getting at it. I'll just beat you up for it, then. <laughs> What's stopping me? 
Good old-fashioned pen and paper is the most secure way of storing information these days. He's not wrong. You know? It's nothing personal. Just business. It's just good business. Also, like... Why would we think that we can get them from cheaper from him? Unless we were gonna, like, compare prices and be like, No, we know you sold this person the tickets for this much, so we want it for that much or less. Only keeping paper records. He's careful. Just as he said, I was hoping we could negotiate with one of his customers. Nothing ever comes cheap. God, do I know that. Oh, boy. Do you think you could distract him for a moment? Huh? He had a bag near his feet. That must be where he keeps the paper with his customer information. Huh? Don't worry, I won't steal it. I'm not so sure about this, but I'll do as she asked. Here goes. Look! It's Jimmy Ken! Wow, is it Mr. Navit? We'll do that one. Mr. Navit? Really? A photo of him might be worth a lot. Where is he? Run! Now's my chance. I don't know why he would just leave his bag there. This must be the customer list. Done. Does she have a photographic memory? Despite her having a memory issue? Bah, he wasn't there. Was someone messing with me? Yeah, who would do such a thing? Not me. It worked. Hmm? I memorized the whole list. Huh? Wormon told you, right? My brain is connected to the Eden server. Once I acquire visual information, it gets converted to data. There were only a few dozen names and some contract com bleh, some contract details for each one. It wasn't hard. Hmm. Well, okay, I didn't realize that her brain was just always connected to the internet. I thought it was like she went and got connected to the internet to download some of her memories just in case. That's weird, Erica. One of the customers is a hacker who owes my brother a favor. He's one of the dinosaurists. Whoa. If you talk to him, he might let you have a ticket. Their territory is on Kowloon level 2. Go and check it out. Oh, yeah, okay. I'm tired. I'll wait for you back at Hudi. And I'm so thirsty. I'm thirsty, too. I don't know what is it all the talking it might be all the talking I do during stream but like I get so thirsty the hacker with the ticket is in Calum level 2 I'll go and see if he'll let me have one do such a thing sounds pretty sus oh, absolutely we're a hacker all we do is sus stuff All right, Kowloon level two, here we come. That's under Kowloon. You know what? We just want Kowloon. Also, I do have food on the way. So I don't know when stream's gonna end per se, but I'm gonna try to. I'm gonna try to finish this mission, at least. Oh. Fancy seeing you here. Are you on a case? Yeah, I'm trying to get a ticket. A ticket for the Eden preview. What a coincidence. I'm on the same case for a different client. Aw, oh, jeez. Don't waste time chatting. Go and find my ticket. Be quiet. I'm working for free here, kid. You should show some gratitude. Ah. Uh. This kid hired me to get a preview ticket. He really wants one for his little sister. Oh. I think we're working on the same case. Huh? You know that his sister's name is Mina? How'd you know that? I see. It looks like we have the same goal. 
So, she's trying to get a ticket by herself. Pretty smart. Then you don't need to bother with my case. Are you giving up? If you both find a ticket, we'll end up with an extra one. Hmm. I can't believe I let her manipulate me like this. She's so stubborn, and she doesn't listen to a word I say. But she never gives up. I'll admit that much. She just gets on my nerves. But didn't you hire me because you want to make her happy? Oh. Once I take a case, I see it through to the end. I'll get you that ticket. You can use the extra one. Go with her and look after her. That's a big brother's job, right? I guess so. That is settled. Sean, get the fuck out of here. I've only just taken this case. I was just about to get to work. Have you got any ideas? Uh, yeah, if you leave Eden and go and talk to someone... Nakama. Ugh, fuck. I see. Asking one of the dinosaurus hackers. That sounds pretty promising. I'll go with you. We'll have a better chance of success. Let's see if we can't solve the brother's case and my sis and the sister's case at the same time. Okay, but there's no guarantee they'll have two tickets to give to us, so... Wait for us in the open space. Where we're going is no place for kids. Thanks. I just hope you can pull it off. Leave it to us. Uh, let's see. Training and investigation are done. These Digimon folk dancers are all right in my book. They're great on stage. I'm sorry, what? <laughs> I would love to see Digimon folk dancing. Can we go see some Digimon folk dancing? Anyone? Anyone want to, like, check out some Digimon folk? Uh, Folk dancing. I, sh I shouldn't even activate it. Not worth it. Okay, we're going to command you to investigate. And you command train no cam down, please, for the love of God. Was Mud Frigimon just rolling? Get her, do it again, Mud Frigimon. Do it again. Oh my God. Who decided that that was a good idea? I don't hate it though. It, it's just it's funny. Okay. All right, uh, acceleration. I really wish we could just activate this all the time, but okay. Okay, I gotta find someone who's not usually here. Gobbly man, goodbye. Oh, we can get another Yokomon now. I think I have the thing to turn off encounters, or at least like lessen encounters. Uh, yeah. High security. Might need that here. I don't know why this room has just like such a low frame rate. It gets so bad in here specifically. It's so weird. I don't know if it shows up on stream as well. Or as poorly. 
It's pretty nasty on my end. Goodbye, Gobbymon. Thanks for the data. Are they really in the deepest part of Kowloon 2? Oh, Tamamon! Bandai should make one of those Otama phones. I think I think that's what they're called. The little thing that looks like a music note and you squeeze it and it makes a sound. Um, but they should make an Otamamon one. I kind of want to get one to be honest. They seem like really annoying, but also kind of fun. Ah, Ryuji, what are you doing here? What kind of gritty is that? Can I drop in on an old friend? You only ever come to see me when you've got some crazy request. Don't be like that. I'm the one who kept you from going to prison, remember? I'd say you owe me a favor or two. Ooh. That's what you always say. So, what is it this time? I want your tickets for the Eden Upgrade Preview. You must be kidding! They're almost impossible to find. Do you have any idea how long it took me to get them? There's no way I'd even sell them, let alone just give them away. Not even to you. In that case, how about a wager? I honestly, like... He doesn't have to wager these tickets. A wager? This is our new hacker. Do battle with him. And then Sean will accidentally press the button. Um, if you win, I'll take as many cases as you want for free. There's no log or anything? Come on, game. You serious? My own personal errand boy. I like the sound of that. Come on, don't I have a say in this? What if you lose? Well, you'll never win with that negative attitude. If you lose, you're out of beauty. Oh, you're gonna regret this. I'm one of the best on my team. If you want to blame anyone, blame your leader over there. Oh. Okay, two champions. Not bad. Not bad. Uh, not great either. I'm being honest. Um. Yeah. Oh, that Gecko Mon is so dead. Or not. Interesting. Okay. Well, we'll just spider shooter that. And still not kill it. Wow. Actually surprising. And this guy doesn't know any moves that hit everybody. Alright, just get, get rid of it, please. Ah. Yeah, let's see if we can remove Cyclone Mon. No, not even close. Infermon, no! Vegeta Jr., no! Damn. I'm using like all my heavy hitting attacks and like not doing anything. Destruction Cannon 3? Jesus. Okay, I really wanna just like go for taking care of Gazimon, but I gotta heal Infermon. Mirror reflection. Got so much damage. 
take so much damage. A uh, wind cloth? I'll probably kill it. Okay. I think this thing put up a thing to block magic attacks. So physical attacks should be fine? Probably. And that's a magic attack, so we don't want to use that. Everything else is physical, though. Bonk. What if I did like a really weak special? Uh, we'll boost Rapid Mon. No, don't cross combo the thing that's gonna reflect. God damn it. Oh, it's still up. Okay, it's not like a one time use, just. Okay, so I think I gotta wait for it to go down. Oh dear. Oh no. Definitely bit off a little more than I can chew here. But that's fine. Um, item? Yeah. Let's give them a spray. Okay. Skill, chain plus on Rapid Mon. Okay. Okay, that was a good hit. It was a really good hit. Spider Shooter might be able to take it out now. Or not. Turbo Stinger, though. There we go. Okay, that was actually kind of tough. But I think it's because, like, Infermon's such a low level. Maybe. Uh, okay. You're up. Uh, Destruction Cannon 2. That's pretty good. Did Wasmon not level up from that? Jesus Christ. What does a guy have to do to get a Digimon to level up around here? No, I lost! Damn, you're strong! Hehe. <laughs> I think about it. You're Yuji's protege. I should have known you were something special. I can't believe I fell for that. We won, fair and square. You know what to do. Fine. Take him, you thief. We are kind of a thief. What? Did you hire them to get a ticket? Yeah, I got two. So I don't want to see any more tears from you. Okay, thanks. You're the best. I actually wanted to go to preview with you all along. And thanks to you two. And thanks to you two. Now we can go to the preview. Yay! Let's go. I need to go home and decide what to wear. Never actually thought about that. Does... Does, like, signing into Eden scan you entirely and, like, put your clothes in? Whatever. Hey, wait up. Calm down. Case complete. Huh? What was my payment? Don't laugh, but it was a Digimon medal and a plastic model. You too? Haha! <laughs> Those two are so alike. I know that payment was nowhere near enough for all our hard work, but it's good to do stuff like this sometimes. Oh, 
Lowell, welcome back. Good work with the case. Thanks. I heard you helped. That girl was so happy to get a ticket. I just did it for the payment. She left a comment saying she'll bring Wooper later. I can't wait. By the way, I poured you some juice. So nice of you. What's with the face? Can't I reward you after a hard day's work? I'm getting Wooper thanks to you. Here, you have some too. Thanks, Erica. Oh. Huh? No, it's nothing. It's not often to see Erica pour a drink for someone. Drink up. I think she likes you. Don't touch her. Gulp, gulp, gulp. Boy? It's so sweet. It's nice, but so sweet. Too sweet. It's like the insides of my mouth are being coated with syrup. Is this even safe to drink? Ouch! I suddenly felt an excruciating pain in every single one of my teeth. Could it be so sweet that it instantly gave me cavities in all my teeth? No. I was so proud of not having a single cavity. I remember back in the day. Weird side tangent. I didn't go to the dentist's office when I showed. I did not take care of my teeth. I did go to the dentist when I was young and I was very surprised I didn't have any cavities. But then the next time I went, which was quite a while later, not just like, you know, a year or six months or something, but like a few years, they were just like, yeah, no, you're like, your mouth is a wreck. You need so much work. And I was like, oh, okay. It's very sad. I, I don't want cavities. No. Hey, snap out of it. It looks like the sweetness made me pass out. How rude of, uh, how rude do you have to be to collapse after drinking juice that someone made for you? Oh, that's right. I made it. Don't look so surprised. I've been known to do thoughtful things from time to time. It was sweet, right? She has an unusual sweet tooth. Yeah, I'll say. The juice they sell is never sweet enough. That's why I always make my own in Cafe's Drink Corner. I put lots of glucose in it. Glucose is the only fuel the brain can use. I know it's very sweet, but it's good once you get used to it. How about another glass? No, no, no! You don't have to look that disgusted. It may be a little, too, it may be a little too sweet, but I always try to get the flavor balance just right. My brother always enjoys it. See, he finished the whole glass in one go. Oh. I wouldn't want to hurt your feelings. I'm your big brother after all. You know, I was just about to say that's kind of like, um, you Narukami from Persona 4. He kind of looks like you, but like a little more grown up. Weird. Ryuji. Like that's a very like protagonist thing to do. Seeing Erica smile, Ryuji looked so happy and proud, but his knees were shaking like crazy. <laughs> I kind of, kind of saw something like that coming. Let's report it to the birth by sleep. Hacker rank up! I'm now an average hacker, and we got some new cases too. Golemon. I swear to God, I'm keeping it this time. All right, that's where I'm gonna call it today because it seems like lunch is ready. So we're gonna save. Everyone, thank you for being here. Fig Leaf, Luke, pause. Thank you for coming in, saying hi. I appreciate it. We are gonna go over and raid Fig Leaf copy who is doing um the uh the relay race for avier so we're gonna give them some love over there there we go okay yeah that's it for me for today and i will 
See everyone on Monday for more Yakuza. Have a good weekend.